How is it going guys? Thanks a lot for joining me once again. Today I'm going to be looking at another beer sent to me by my buddy Steve. Another IPA from Twin Sales Brewing. Um, today's beer is going to be Disco Nap Double IPA. Loving the artwork. Looks absolutely awesome. 70s, 80s kind of thing going on. Really cool. 8.1% um, alcohol by volume. They're using a Denali. Um, uh, Azaka and Equinaut hop, hops in this one and uh, yeah they're only using a barley for uh, grains in this one which is surprising based on the uh, appearance on it I mean that is absolute haze for days that is that opaque New England juice bomb kind of appearance it pours like pineapple juice <laughs> unfiltered pineapple juice that looks awesome and the glass a yeah, finger of a super Fluffy, uh, frothy, meringue-like, bright white head. Let's get an aroma. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That's like gooseberry. Kiwis. Some sort of other berry in there. Very berry-forward aroma to this beer. There's this greenness, but not like a hot greenness. It's some sort of, yeah, like kiwi, something like that going on. Like a green fruit. That does not smell like a uh, beer at all. Yeah, some passion fruit stuff like that going on. That smells absolutely divine. Wow. Yeah, I'm starting to pick up some resinous after all. Very, very complex smell and uh, hot profile to this. I mean, that smells absolutely friggin' delicious. Yeah, that reminds me of like Congress Street, of uh, um, Fort Point. Um, if it tastes anywhere, anywhere near what it smells, uh, this is going to be a hummus. <laughs> All right, let's try it out. Cheers, everybody. Oh wow. Wow. That is so earthy, herbaceous. It's got like hints of coriander to this, like uh, basil, stuff like that going on. Very like dank, green basil kind of thing, that hot matter thing as well. beautiful sweetness to the beer. There's a little tinge of alcohol, just to let you know it's 8% and you shouldn't be doming can upon can of this, you know, but uh, yeah, there's this beautiful sweet kind of, I want to say like blackberry, something like that. Yeah, I've been eating lots of blackberry lately and it's got that like uh, tannic dry yet sweet kind of blackberry flavor. That is absolutely awesome. Very unique hot profile. I I haven't had much beers, much hoppy beers with this complex of a uh, hot profile. I mean, that is super sweet, but still a nice bitterness to the beer. Very well balanced. The mouthfeel is phenomenal. Uh, yeah, that that is awesome, awesome stuff. Ugh, excuse me. It's a super dense, uh, heavy kind of beer, full body, but there is a spritzy kind of carbonation just to uh, make it all the more drinkable, you know? There's nothing I can really fault in this. This is phenomenal stuff. Um, yeah, you, usually in beers, uh, I I don't like booziness in it at all. At all. Um, I like my booze to be hidden completely, but this beer, I think uh, if it didn't have that certain boozy spark to it, you could get yourself into a lot of trouble. I mean, that is a dangerous, dangerous beer. That 
that is straight fucking fire. <laughs> That's uh, Disco Nat from uh, Twin Sales. One of the best IPAs I've had all year. Probably ever. I mean, only things I can think of that rival this beer right now are those uh, double dry hop like uh, Trillium beers I had uh, a couple months ago. Yeah, that's awesome. That is absolutely, absolutely phenomenal beer. Um, yeah, kiwi, dank herbaceous herbs, big tropical fruit, big berries, some lychee stuff like that going on, that creamy kind of lychee kind of thing. I want more of this. I mean, this is phenomenal. It's not super fresh either. I think it's like a... Um, six seven weeks old um but the hot profile is phenomenal i think uh fresh this would be maybe a little bit too green you know but as it is now i wish i had another can age it for another like month or two see see how it is like that you know like that is awesome that is a great beer yeah this is definitely a hunnitz no reason to keep on with the uh review that is a perfect beer in my opinion. Yeah, I wouldn't change a thing. That is awesome. <laughs> All right, but uh, yeah, that's been Disco Nap from Twin Sales. Huge, huge thanks to Steve, Steve for sending this one out to me. <laughs> really, really appreciate you doing uh, that for me, man. Like, that is really good. Um, I'm gonna have a heck of a time drinking this. So yeah, thanks for watching everybody. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you think of this beer, any other Twin Sales brewskis, and until the next time, cheers.